Moon World Films. Just watching this uh, Betty Davis interview. Very interesting. Very. Put on your shoes one at a time. Put on your glasses one at a time. Put on your hat one at a time. This hat is a... uh, one of a kind hat. It says Ish Niener Forest. Today is the last day of my vacation um, that I've been on for a while now. A week. A week. sunlight in the world during the daytime. I like the inside, the interiors of places, buildings. What's this on my nose? Yep, another real nice day. Let me show you some of the things that are behind me in my videos. Over here I have some of the uh, McFarlane Beatles figures. This here is the uh, record album cover that I designed for Marshmallow Coast for his album Memory Girl. This is the uh, initial drawing that I did for my album cover uh, Temples and Pyramids. Here is me and my step uh, grandfather off of my mother who is uh, who is playing with me as a teeny tiny baby boy in front of an organ and here's the organ that I was playing in that photo here is X the owl who was uh, gifted to me from my friends Tony and Kimberly they uh, got this at a place called Idle Wild. Idle Wild, and at Idle Wild, it's in Pennsylvania. There is a um, Mr. Rogers neighborhood area with a ride and uh, merch and puppets. This uh, big picture of a violin I found many, many years ago at a uh, thrift store and I've just always kept it kept it in my uh, music room. Here is a vinyl record that hangs up on the wall and it's my favorite Beatles song. You know my name, look up the number. The, uh, the A side, that's the B side, is Let It Be. I'm a huge uh, Beach Boy Smile fan. I love the, the Smile song. Here is uh, an action figure of Counselor Deanna Troy. This here is a sketch of what became the uh, album cover art for my album Mystic Ukulele. And right here below is my ticket to see Jeff Lynne's ELO. And of course here is the album cover to Mystic Ukulele. Here is a uh, guitar note chart that I uh, put together so I can figure things out. Here is a uh, poster of uh, some sort of spaceship landing on a jungle planet and uh, there's little tiny earthling, I mean spacemen, astronauts landing on a planet of monkeys. 
So who knows what that's about. I don't, I'm not sure who even made this picture. Down below here next to my uh, virtual drums, my piezoelectric drums, is this picture that I drew for my grandmother. And she had it in her bedroom for many years. She got it framed and uh, she passed away. And I recently got this back after, I don't know, 15 something years, 15, 20 years. Here is the uh, encore ukulele that my grandmother gave me. It was the very first instrument that was like a guitar that I ever played. Here's a uh, drawing I drew of a UFO over the moon. And recently, I pulled this sticker off a gas pump and I said, hmm, taking that off. So I put it over here in the corner. This here is a uh, action figure that my friend Tony gave me many, many Christmases ago. It's like a oh, rat fink sort of inspired uh, character based off of, I guess, this art that was uh, based off that art and they made an action figure out of it. And uh, finally, here's a uh, mini Korg that I've used on a lot of songs. So there you have it. That's uh, just a little bit of this room. I don't want to show everything in this room. So oh, I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching and please subscribe for more of my cool content. Also, you can check out my other cool content on these other social media sites like Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and Bandcamp. So, see you next time. Moon World Recordings by Schneider Forest. <laughs>